Now, here's Chief Meteorologist Tony Petrarca with your Pinpoint Weather 12 forecast. Well, we're still looking at significant weather changes over the next five days. And the first change that we'll notice this evening and tonight, the humidity really jumping up. A very tropical, muggy day coming up for tomorrow. And that high humidity will act as fuel. It will uh, help to initiate... Uh, uh, heavy downpours and some thunderstorms uh, for your Wednesday. In the meantime, it's a beautiful evening. No problems uh, finishing up a, a gorgeous day today. Down in Newport, the sun is shining. Temperatures that are in the uh, lower 80s right now. Uh, the beaches have been uh, just spectacular as well. These are live pictures at Narragansett Town Beach. So uh, looking pretty good. High temperatures today is expected topping out in the upper 80s. 87 in Providence as well as Taunton. And then lower to middle 80s along the, uh, the coastline. We have a very warm day for tomorrow. Somewhere in that 85 to 90 range, but with the humidity, it will feel warmer. Smithfield now coming in at 86 degrees in Oakland Beach and Warwick now at 85. But the humidity level is not too bad, but they're starting to rise, and you'll really notice it throughout the evening and into the overnight. So that muggy weather making a return. Tropical moisture remnants from once uh, Hurricane Barry will interact with a couple of other weather features to give us scattered showers and thunderstorms uh, tomorrow afternoon, tomorrow evening into Thursday. Now, tomorrow's not the kind of day where it's just raining nonstop every hour. There'll be lulls. It's, it's very scattered. You get a downpour, you get a strong strong thunderstorm, some gusty wind, and then you may get a break for a couple of hours and then another downpour coming by. So that kind of a deal. And the uh, much advertised heat wave on the way Friday to Sunday. Now you combine the high heat along with high humidity and the feel like temperatures over the weekend will be running over 100 degrees. That's the heat index. A few passing clouds coming through right now. Storms and showers in upstate New York. Uh, not a factor in our forecast for this evening, but here's some of that remnant moisture from once uh, Barry area of low pressure and that'll be moving north and east arriving here for uh, tomorrow and into a uh, Thursday uh, getting real close let me walk you through how it all plays out as far as showers and thunderstorms looking good for this evening it's kind of warm and humid uh, temperatures will stay in the 70s all night long now for tomorrow morning I really don't see much other than maybe a passing shower uh, warm and muggy to start the day and then during the afternoon hours watch how things start to light up in these areas of orange and red indicating downpour so it's the kind of deal where you know one town may be getting a strong thunderstorm and a downpour and the next town over there's nothing going on so it, it's scattered but it's certainly high impact two o'clock in the afternoon you see these downpours coming through uh, temperatures muggy warm in the upper 80s to briefly near 90 and then by uh, five o'clock in the evening still looking at the risk of scattered showers and thunderstorms temperatures in the 80s and then by tomorrow evening a lot of this will be uh, winding down later at night so for tomorrow morning other than a passing shower don't see much in the way of storms or downpours uh, a different story though <clears throat> for Wednesday afternoon scattered showers and thunderstorms and the concern here is that some of these thunderstorms may be strong frequent lightning strong gusty winds the kind of downpours that can sometimes create localized street flooding, so be mindful of that. And then the heat is on Friday through Sunday, 90 Friday, 97 Saturday, 96 Sunday. You throw in the humidity and that heat index or feel like temperature over the weekend is running um, over 100 degrees. All right, seven day forecast. You talk about the heat index, for instance, on Saturday, which is probably when the heat will peak, the actual air temperature 97, and these feel like temperatures running anywhere from 105 to 107 de degrees. That's dangerous heat, obviously. So, uh, more than likely, some sort of heat advisory will be issued uh, over the weekend. Maybe some cooling centers will be open. So, uh, we'll keep you updated on that. In the meantime, keep the umbrella on standby both Wednesday and Thursday. Not raining all the time, but every now and then you will get a strong thunderstorm. Storm uh, and some downpours. All right, Tony, thanks. More coverage you can.